But that is your own business, so. As for me, I'm going to watch the masquerade. Yeah, that one not your concern. I've told you, I must respect any teacher that comes into this school. Mm -hmm. I mean, nobody knows tomorrow. Respect is reciprocal. Let's just check out. Go, go, go ahead and respect even a dog in this school. As for me, our economy tutor is a right off. Let me tell you, people. That man is Randy. He does not even respect his age at all at all. Anyway, who knows? Goma might be among his niche. What? Mm. Joy, yes. why are you sounding like this? Are we not friends? Yes, we are. We know each other's character in this school. Mm. We know those who are follow follow. <laughs> are you not counting me as one of them, Joy? <laughs> Ugoma, we know you respect her. Mm. We know you are real KYS. Real KYS. That's what you are. Ah. Hey! <laughs> You sounding worldly. Eh? Why? Although I still wonder what will make Eddie change his mind at the last minute. Can you imagine? Can you imagine, Sister Elizabeth? Just five days to go. Five days to go and see my parents for the wedding proper. Five it's days okay, to it's go. Okay. It's okay. Relax. In every situation, learn to give God glory. He knows best. God knows best. Angel Michael knows best. Angel Gabriel knows wow. best. How many more times will I get to hear this? Where's your faith? Eh? Have you lost your faith? Are you doubting God? Okay, go ahead and cry over spilled milk. So what am I going to tell my parents this thing? Simple. He's a coward. He developed cold feet and he changed his mind. <laughs> Listen, you don't understand. I do understand. Listen to me. God knows why things work out this way. And you showed me the plans he now. Will. He will. Show me the plans. What am I going to do? You don't know how I feel. This little plan. Yeah. Who come on? I repeat, you are a total failure and disappointment. Count the number. Edmond is making them 15. 15 fled suitors of yours. Shame unto you. Come on. Now come on. Let's take it easy with them. I believe God's time is the best. Someday she will marry. Someday? Mm -hmm. At the age of 45, you still expect a man to marry this idiot? I am still hoping upon the Lord. If I see a husband, I will marry. I'm not the cause. Instead of bringing a man home, you came with a worthless cat. You know that your father is right. Why have you continued turning down suitors? Mama, if it's the will of the Lord that I get married, 
I will get married. Grandma, don't attract the wrath of your parents and stop bringing reproach to us. Remember, your mates are married and settled in their homes. Excuse me. In fact, Pastor, I'm tired. I'm sick of my parents hustling me. Do you know my father threatened to disown me? That I remain a spinster at this age? My sister, cheer up. Cheer up. Just don't disturb yourself. Wait upon the Lord. You know the church I've been praying for you? They that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings like eagles. They pastor, shall run pastor, with... pastor, how long will this reproach remain in my life? I'm confused. I don't know what to do. It's alright. It's so okay. If I may suggest, why don't you marry Brother Kenny that have been disturbing you all this while? Why don't you marry him? Pastor Everest, he's a good brother. God forbid. Pastor, you expect me to marry a man almost twice younger than me? I'm sure even God would not accept his proposal. Well, I was just expressing my candid opinion. Just a suggestion. It is all up to you. You know what you want for yourself. It's not all right. It's not. Papa. Why is your sister is that rich? Why are you still in store? Well, as it pleases the Lord. Stop being unnecessarily secretive. Does God delight in the suffering of his children? Um, Brother Mike, uh, I'll be comfortable if we leave this uh, discussion for now. Maybe some other time. No, brother. I want us to discuss this matter now. I want to know why you are hawking in spite of your sister's affluence. <laughs> Well, it all started a long time ago. One early morning in my sister's house. Yes, come in. Respect 
I, I want to talk to you. I said, who was that? I heard somebody's voice. That's what I want to talk to you about. Please, if you don't mind, please sit down. Okay. I'm all ears. Sister, I've tried several times to mention this thing to you, but each time I try to avoid seeing this thing, my conscience won't let me. Go ahead. Nothing is ever new. Sister, it's about your habit of bringing in different men into your matrimonial home. I mean, just because your husband has traveled overseas. I mean, me, I feel it's wrong. I mean, scripturally, it's wrong. The Bible is against it. Morally, I feel... Paul! You are a big fool. Paul, I said, you are a big fool. Look at you with your conscience. I mean, look at you, Paul, with your conscience. I think you've overstayed your welcome in this house. Go in there, pack your things, and leave my house. No, sister, I, I'm, I'm only trying to save or remedy a situation that's capable of destroying your marriage, your joy, your happiness. Paul, I said, go in there, pack your things, and leave my house. It's over between me and you. Go out there and continue with your newfound faith. After all, you're old enough to fend for yourself. Better leave my house. Nonsense. Sister, don't blame me. Well, brother Mike. That was the genesis of my suffering. I wasn't able to finish my education after that. And there was no way your parents could help out. My poor father. I was a poor and old man. You know, we solely depended on my sister because see, my mother died a long time ago. Never lose hope, brother. God is in control. I will take you to my pastor for prayers. Um, I'll be glad if you do that. I'll do. Take it easy. I'll do. <laughs> Amara, I said kneel down. Kneel down. I said kneel down. Kneel down, you are Kneel down. Kneel down, Amara. Are you, are you not hearing me? I said kneel down. Kneel down. Ah, kneel down, foolish girl. What is it? Can you imagine a girl that the mother entrusted in my care in the school? I saw her kissing a boy down the street. Eh? And she saw me and ran away. Is that true? I'm asking you, is that true? You know the best thing? You have to tell her mother that you cannot continue. Because from the way I see this one, she's already rotten. You understand me? Oh, yeah, you. To your class. Go back to your class. Can you imagine? Uh -uh. They actually just kissed and pushed me. Maybe let's go back to class. my daughter. Mama, is that what you're supposed to ask me? I mean, do you suppose I would have flogged her without justifiable reason? Justifiable reason, my foot. Ugoma, are you not supposed to ask yourself questions? Why are you transferring your frustration and aggression on innocent children under your care? Why? Mama, I'm right, but have you forgotten you begged me to keep Hamara under my care? Yes, then she becomes your pro vengeance, eh? Do you know how or what it takes to be a mother? Nonsense, Spencer. Ghost, Spencer, winch. 
Let me just warn you. Let me just warn you for the last time. Good man. Any other day you touch her, man. Any other day you touch her, that would be the end of your wickedness. Sadist. Today. Oh, well, we thank God. We are suffering and smiling. <laughs> Don't worry, it shall be well. Amen. So, guess what? What? I brought some goodies for you. <laughs> Sister Koma. So, let's go inside and you'll be surprised. Okay, oh. I can't wait to see this. <laughs> let's go now.
Victoria, Abigail. Where are you girls coming from? We went on break. Break. And you're coming back at this time? Auntie, we are sorry. Please. Abigail. Yes, Auntie. Listen to me. If you allow yourself to fall for the antiques of worldly men, get yourself pregnant and stop schooling, you will only have yourself to blame. Thanks. Frankly speaking, we did not go out with any Victoria, I'm only advising you ladies. See, my Bible says, the soul that sinneth shall die. They say a word is enough for the wise. You can go back to your class. I feel that she's envious of us. Yes. After all, an old cargo like her doesn't get men attention in the world. That's what it should be. <laughs> My sister, let's go. But if I were her, I would go to a juju man for love portion. Huh? So that I can help a man. Sometimes I wonder why God allows his followers to suffer. Oh God, that's blasphemy. Remember we have to give account of spoken words. Well, may God forgive me then. Better. So why did you say that? My period. What about your period? Stopped four months ago. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Don't tell me that you're... I, are you Elizabeth is not what you think. I went to see the doctor. He said my menopause has set in. What? Does it start that early? Well, the doctor says it starts early in some women and later in some women. Whatever. After all, I'm no longer a kid, you know. Well, does it mean then that if you eventually get married, you might not be able to give your husband children? <laughs> That's if I will ever get married. I'll do start again. Who cares about a grandmother like me? Just tell me. Hi, what is this? Who what? cares about me? Please. Why are you always doing this? Who cares about me? You think I'm not worried about getting married too? You think I'm not growing older myself? I have just decided to commit myself into the hands of God and hold on to my faith. I know that's some... Elizabeth, I don't know what you to do. Elizabeth, Elizabeth, Elizabeth. 
I'm not. I'm just a monkey. Oh, God! Don't do this! Please! Listen! <laughs> Grandma, I did not come here to socialize with you, but to ask you as a mother why you have decided to rob shame all over me. Now tell me, what offense did I commit? What offense did I commit by bringing you into this world? should have taken something before this discussion. Every other thing can wait, unless I am at this first. Are the sitters no longer coming or what? Mama, I'm waiting upon the Lord. He knows best. Shut up! I said shut up! How long will you wait upon that your God? Look at you. Just look at yourself. Imagine Florence, Victoria, Alice, your mates, have got the children who are graduates. You deserve pity. Take it or leave it. You deserve pity. Mama, I will not because of you or anyone else go against the will of God in my life. I will not. I can't. Ah. You can't. That's all right. We will see. And should anything happen to your father because of you, you will regret it. Ugoma, you will regret it. Mama, nothing will happen to Papa. Okay. Anyway, I am glad you came. Mama, I would like you to accompany me to my church. We have a we have a crusade coming up. I'd like you to attend. My only concern is to have my grandchildren. It's all right, Mama. 
please. I would like you to go to him. The Lord God is your strength. The Bible says many are the afflictions of the righteous, but the Lord God delivered him from them all. The Lord shall deliver you. Amen. The Lord will set you free. Amen. He understands all you've been going through. He knows your tears. He will strengthen you. Amen. Thank you, Pastor. Thank you so much. I hope Brother Paul will trust in the Lord. Pastor, I have never felt so light. In my entire life. Thank you very much, sir. We thank God. Uh, meanwhile, I think we should go to the church hall now. That's for the Bible studies. Hmm? Okay, sir.
the meaning of all these malaria dreams while they get lit. Now wow, this has gone beyond imaginations. You getting wedded to your grandmother? Hmm. Advice you go for a cost breaking prayer and fasting. I think it's very necessary now. Yeah. I mean, Ever since I, I attended that your church, it seems the devil has not been happy with me. Eh? And I will start that from tomorrow. Start from tomorrow. It shall be well, brother. God has solution for everything. Hey, meanwhile, how about sister Koma? Hey, Koma, how about that sister? Oh, that sister. It's very wonderful sister. Faithful, God fearing, prayerful. Hey! Man, look, that sister eh, should make a good housewife. True. If that is the case, why not make his go to her and propose to her before that snatch her away from you? I go. 
I don't talk finish of me. I never get trousers. Eh? Talk of good money now. And God never reveal for me. My hand not there. I'm going to do my way back to work. I beg you. Bye bye. You. I thank God. They, uh, they are fine. And your husband, I hope he has been communicating with you. Ah, he phones every day. He phones mm, every day. That's alright. Papa, I hope you're getting better. Mm. My daughter, well, I just thank God. Uh, fat, if not for your help, I would have been a buried man by now. Papa, mm. you mean you've not heard from Paul since then? Uh, no. No. Oh. Paul. Paul. But that boy. Mm. I know that wherever he is now, he must be passing through here. I wish I had money. I would have just been supportive to him, at least financially. Papa, you are at it again. You are at it. Papa, you mean you are in support of the insult that prodigal son of yours gave me, eh, Papa? Is that what you're telling me, Papa? Uh, I thought you should have forgotten this by now. For what? He's your only brother. For what? Papa, listen. Listen and listen good. Papa, if you don't stop disturbing me about that prodigal son of yours, I will buy court visiting you. Do you get me? No, my daughter, it has not come to that now. Anyway, uh, let me get the things I brought for you from the It has not come to that. Let it be that I wish you just allow me to die a happy man. Please, let me have a united family around me. Father, Lord, I cancel everything. Every oath, every curse, every invocation on the land, in the sea, in the air, against my life, against my future, against my family, in the name of Jesus.
Are you okay? What, what is the problem? Seriously. Sorry. Are you okay? It's okay. Don't just sit down. The pastor was sweet. this woman come to the church? Where exactly will I run to? I, I, I am convinced to go myself, witch. I'm about to find my dead body. She can't hook me. I must leave this town in a hurry. Sister Koma, Sister Koma. What, what about Sister Koma? She's lost on her way back from the school and she has been rushed to the hospital. Slumped? Yes. Rushed to the hospital? Yes. Um, is it that serious? She's very serious. And she made mention of your name. The doctor is requesting to see you immediately. Mention my name? Yes. Why? I wouldn't know. Um, okay, uh, the incident just occurred now. Yes. Okay, uh, let me just go inside and change. I'll okay. join you. Okay. Sorry. Okay. Come Jesus Christ, your word in Isaiah 42 verse 41 verse 10 says that you are my God, I should be not dismayed. Father, I hold on to your word, for your word will never be remembered. Everlasting King of glory. Father, open your book of remembrance today. Father, open my book of remembrance. Father, pour down your oil of gladness upon me. Father, pour down your oil of gladness upon me. Father, King of glory, put a new song in my mouth. Father, put a word of testimony in my mouth. That your name alone shall be glorified in the mighty name of Jesus. I take authority as a servant of God, and I begin to run against the sanctity of the house, rulers of the world of darkness and wickedness. Every disappointment in my life be disannulled by the blood of Jesus. Every spirit of hatred, every veil of disguise upon my mind, I tear you by fire. I tear you by fire. I tear you by fire. Every veil of disguise, every veil of wickedness. Every veil of reproach, I share you by fire in the name of Jesus. I will never cast it in our Satan. I feel 
feel, I mean, I feel free. I was streaming. I heard this voice and it was saying I'm free. You heard a voice? Yes. And the voice said you're free? Yes. Do you believe you're free? Yes, I believe I'm free. <laughs> Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Amen. we honor you, we bless you, we give you glory. Father, there is power in spoken words. As she has confessed her freedom, she is free indeed Amen. in Jesus' name. Her deliverance is permanent in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Father, we bless you for all the beautiful things you've done. We bless you for the wonderful things you're doing. We bless you for the beautiful things you're about to do in our yes, lives. Lord. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Let your name alone be glorified. Amen. Now and forevermore. Amen. Thank God for you. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> You'll be alright, okay? Don't worry, we'll go to the pastor. He's going to pray for you and you'll be alright, okay? Find it in now. Okay. Mm -hmm. Good luck. Thank you, brother. Oh, what? Who gave this load? Put your own bike. 
Which? Which? From the local government. Let's okay. hey? see your hawker's permit. Two years tax receipt and sanitation trees receipt. Hawker's permit? Yes. Ah! Okay, I never hear that kind of thing before. This is the first kind of time I hear hawker's permit. So, person go, they suffer from error, see they pay government. Do you think we are here for argument? Come on, follow. Which, which can I come up for follow be that? Hey, hey, hey. If I don't want to push me again, no. what is that? You have to better respect yourself. Just come to our office. 20,000 Naira. 20,000 Naira cash. You see the mouth. 20,000 Naira. You get that right? You get 20,000 cash. Come on, come on. Get ready. Get ready. Come on, get ready. Come on, get ready. Come on, get ready. What's the worry? I'm going to start with you. What's the worry? Police. Give my goods. Hey! Please. Are you not afraid? Man, let's go. 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 Let's go.
this is that this has been a bit long story. Aguna, ah! <laughs> I greet you. I have come to give you thanks. You are great. You are the strong voice of the abjasis open the boil of a corpse. <laughs> this is for you. Um, I have come to give you thanks and to ask you for a favor. I want you to protect Paul for me. Please let no evil before him wherever he is. You are great. I know you will do it. You have done it already. Thank you. <laughs> uh, <laughs> again this is hot thank you i thank you very much you have done it for me <laughs> i know paul is safe already if it has gotten to you doubting god then you have a problem can't you see the convictions the signs the prophecies that paul is your god sent lisbeth when people Accuse me of using evil force or love charm on him. Then take it to God in prayer and bind that spirit of doubt in you. It is satanic. What would I tell our pastor? Have you forgotten I turned down Brother Kenneth, who's far older than Paul due to age differences? The good Lord who is the master planner will reveal himself to our pastor. Oh God. So what do I do? Give him the Lord. Accept his proposals. Just like that? Just like that. Or what other conviction do you need? <laughs> you said you have soup in the fridge. Yes. I'm too. hungry. Accepted my proposal. What are you rejoicing about? How do you mean? What's the meaning of all this? Because an old woman, old enough to be your mother, tricked you into proposing to her. That's why you are rejoicing. Nonsense. What has come over you? Brother Mike, what has come over you? This woman is too old for you! Look, Brother Mike, I will not stand here and watch you insult me. Neither will I be discouraged. Because I know my God is not mocked. He does not mock his people. I only see your position as evil machination. You mean I'm a Satan? You call me Satan? For Paul? Twist it as you may. For your information, Mike, tomorrow I and Sister Go are meeting the marriage committee. Okay? Go there and meet your Waterloo. I shall never be influenced by a witch. God, the battle is yours. Heavenly Father, we thank you this evening. We thank you for the privilege of being here. Thank you for this meeting. 
Father, we are inviting you to come and chairman this meeting, this minute. Heavenly Father, take total preeminence control of everything we're going to discuss here today in Jesus' name. Amen. But when we are gathered here today on the invitation of our brother, Brother Paul, and our sister Ogoma, may they please uh, state their intentions to us. My pastor, respectable men of God, we thank God whose favor it is to keep us alive today. We also want to thank you all for honoring our invitation. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you, sir. As it is our doctrine in this church, we, I mean, I and Sister Goma, have decided to get married. So we came to sort your approval. Thank you, sis. Brethren, you have heard from the horse's mouth. Does anybody have something to say? Pastor, we all know the principle very well. As usual, they should go and wait for our reply. Or is it not so? You are right. Well, Brother Paul and Sister Goma, we would like to advise you both go home while we seek the face of the Lord. I'm sure he's going to talk to us. Then we'll get back to you in due time. Okay? Thank you, Pastor. Thank, Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Wonder shall never end. I knew it. That lady, she's a witch. She has used her witchcraft on the poor boy. I have been suspecting Uguma's repentance. Even though that boy is young enough to be a child. Yes. Think about it. Imagine. My brothers, let us know what ourselves about this case. Let us go and seek the face of the Lord. I'm sure he will talk to us. Sure. If there's problem, that she has a contrary spirit, the spirit of seduction, that she's coming here to come to seduce your brethren here. I'm sure that the Lord will expose her and then she will stand as a deterrent to those who are having intention to do the same. You must have made a mistake now. You must have brought the wrong picture. No, Papa. That's the right picture. Mm. She's the lady. You're not serious. Ah, is this your mother or your auntie? Papa, she's my wife to be. You must be. You must be. You are not serious, in fact. Look, over my dead body. This can happen. Ah, what are you talking about? Ah, is anybody in this house? Come in, come in, come to the backyard, please. I'm asking my brother. Ah, look at this boy, you. Ah, my city boy. You're welcome back home. Thank you, Uncle. Sit down. <coughs> ah, you're welcome, my brother. Irebu, why do you look so, so sad? I'm asking, just have a look at this picture. That is the old man who goes as he says he wants to marry. 
out of all the multitude of girls in the city, this is the person you can choose. What? Hello. Mm -hmm. There is no smoke without fire. Our son, Paul, has been bewitched. How can a young man like him get married to his grandmother? We must consult the oracle. This is abomination. This is abomination. Look, uncle. Stop that. Age is no barrier to, 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 to what God has joined together. Shut up, Paul. You must be sick in your head. You are bonkers. You've gone bonkers. You've gone bananas. You're crackers. Ah! Foolish boy, look at you. How can you say, look, if you know what is good enough for you, you better not get yourself entangled with this old woman. Look at Look, give me that picture. Let me advise you. You better forget about this lady. You better get married to, to your fellow man. Hmm? So that we know what you did. Your parents gave birth to you. For you to, to give birth to other children. How can you get married to your grandmother? Anyway, you know your father very well and what he can do when he is angry. Uncle, forget it. There's no going back. I'm considered married to her. She's cost me for me. Paul! Don't know your oracle. What Paul! Is that a threat? Been drawn near. I will not take it. In truth, old witch, fear. Even my father threatened fire and brimstone. I mean, at the point I had to. Leave the house unannounced. What was the reason? It's not necessary. See, the most important thing is that I love you and I'm willing to do God's perfect will in my life. I know you love me. But you know we cannot be comfortably married without your blessings and support. Nobody's an island, you know. What are you insinuating? That will call off this marriage because of, I mean, empty threats from unbelievers? I didn't say so. Um, Paul. Yeah? Why didn't you tell me that you were engaged to a coma? Which a coma is this? The lady I dropped you with, you know, some time ago, that was throwing up on the street. Oh, my dear, come on. I, I have never thought of it. I'm in top place of doing it. So what is she to you then? Just a sister in the Lord, of course. I mean, what about her? Well, um, she came to my house this afternoon. There was no unprintable name that she didn't call me. What? She even spat at me. She promised to make hell on earth for me. Jesus Christ. Oh, that's, that's nonsense. I'm sorry, sister. I'm really sorry, honey. It's okay. Okay, um, I mean, what's important now is that 
Remember, we're going to see your parents. You should be thinking of how to see them. All right. Ready day is tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, this is a good one. Yeah. We'll start going now. We'll do tomorrow then. Okay. Okay. Um, in that case, I think I just take my my some thoughts from the okay. So okay. If your parents refuse as well. Everything is in the hands of God. I believe he has taken care of everything. You don't have to worry. Come, let's go. Okay. All right. I said earlier on, we would need your blessing and that of the entire family. Uh -huh. Oh, my son. Sir. Are you sure you've, you've decided on your own to marry your grandma? Of course, I'm sure, sir. <laughs> sure. Mm -hmm. Have you informed your parents? Um, yes, yes, yes. I, I've told them. No, grandma. Do you have Ma. anything to say? My son. Ma. Are you sure of what he... Uh, he's okay, Bias. He's sure, okay. Ma. My daughter is okay. <laughs> sure. Yeah, Ugum. Papa. We have already given you our blessing. Do not hesitate to tell us whatever your people think we can contribute to make the wedding successful. Yes. Thank you very much. Hey, the truth of the father. Oh my God. Hey. Nobody, please now. Tell them now. The church please. Papa, uh, one more thing, sir. We would like to get the uh, marriage list, so we can, I mean, according to custom, so we can present to our church committee. Oh. That would be a problem. Yes. Even your father can come for it at any time. All right. Thank you, sir. Uh, no. Go and prepare food for the night. Oh, sir. Oh. Oh. What are you doing? Uh, Papa, I, I stay in the city and um, I'm a businessman. Is that so? Yes, sir. Uh, uh, I hope your parents are okay. Yeah. So, my parents, uh, you meet them someday, maybe at the traditional ground. Okay. We hope to see them. Thank you. Imagine. Hey, imagine, Papa. I abandoned that fool you call Paul. I abandoned him to see whether he'll be responsible and reasonable in life. All he's thinking of is to marry a woman twice my age. What are you telling me, Papa? Eh? Huh? Ruta Adam. Don't bother yourself, okay? I will handle it my own way. Trust me. You handle it, Papa? Yes, of course. Ah. Papa, handle it your own way. Thank you. Um, 
reminds me. Don't you think we should go and see the pastor? Would you believe I was just about to say that? Ah, <laughs> that makes us a worthy couple. <laughs> I must confess, your parents are really, really wonderful. I thank the Lord. Wow. wow. Let's just wait until our wedding day. You'll see what they will do. No, they impressed me. So happy. <laughs> so let's just go to the pastor, okay? Okay. okay. Just before we could give an answer to you people, something cropped up. Sorry, sir. Well, what is that? This letter was brought in here by a sister who said you cheated her after one year courtship. No. Furthermore, she accused two of you of getting involved in an illicit sex, committing fornication in this church. So there's nothing like that. So. Well, brother Paul and Sister Goma, with these accusations, the church committees cannot give the approval. They cannot until necessary investigation is concluded. Pastor. Pastor, be between man and God, I and that sister has nothing between us, safe being brethren. I mean, Sister Goma here now, we've never done any such thing she accused us of. Brother Paul, we cannot do anything now. The church committee cannot give their verdict until necessary investigation is concluded. You have heard me. Thank you. with seven heads. The all-knowing Igwekala. I greet you. Well, 
Stop bothering about the car. That's it. We should be thankful to God that nothing happened to the both of you. What if somebody had got shot? Hmm? There's a look unto the Lord in prayer. Everything will be all right. I'm not even bothering about the car. I just don't know. I mean, why me? Why these trials and temptations. Why me? Always remember that God has actually overcome. Okay? He's perfectly in control. How is your friends? How is he doing, Paul? He's a psychological wreck. Ugo, you ah. have to be strong. You have to be strong for the both of you. Yes, God never said there won't be temptations. He never said there will not be tribulations. But above all, you will triumph. You will overcome. If only you would hold on to your faith. Because you're just gathering testimonies. <laughs> they want to take everything away from me. The joy of the Lord is your strength. Sister Gemma, let us pray. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. That man, he looks like a police dictator. Police? Yes. He's the one that locked your room with another key. Um, did they leave any message for me or any? Yes, they did. They said that you should report to the police station as soon as you return. Hey. Ah, who are those people coming? Paul. Who? That's the criminal. Arrest hey. him, sir. Hmm? Sir, you know this lady? 
Uh, yes, I know her. She's my sister in the Lord. Um, sorry if I may ask, who are you joining me? We are police detectives. You are sent by the legal to come and arrest you. Now move it! Move it! Officer, wait, wait. Move so him! Oga, wait. Oga, wait. I'm just coming in from my hockey now. I've not changed my dirty clothes. Look at my face. Let me just go inside and change and take this in inside. And you can... Call this man! We don't get time to wait, so... Follow up before I Abel, deal with officer, you now! Abel, officer, oh, officer. Such offense did he commit? Abel, no, my neighbor. Pardon you, my bed. This one? Let her promise young lady for marriage. After I don't chop their money finish, you go push them away. Now in this one specialized. Uh, officer, don't, don't insult me. Who, who are chopping money? So now me, you're good love. Uh, officer, anybody money now. Take it out away. Move it. 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 Somebody help! Somebody help! Somebody help! 